States are the primary duty bearers for the protection of human rights of every individual who is on their territory or under their jurisdiction. This could mean internally displaced persons, migrants or any other population affected by crisis. IOM is supporting the states in fulfilling this critical responsibility. When a crisis strikes, uh, the state might be overwhelmed in terms of response and so there could be some uh, groups or part of the population who might be particularly discriminated or neglected. Humanitarian actors like IOM are there to ensure that no one is left behind and those who are most at risk of being targeted by violence or being neglected are going to be prioritized in the assistance and protection. In Yemen we are assisting the humanitarian evacuation of migrants who are affected by the conflict and we do so making sure that families are kept together and when for instance children are identified as unaccompanied or separated we work with national stakeholders as well as with international partners to ensure that a solution in the best interest of the child is always identified. In Nigeria, we work with internally displaced persons, and especially in Northeast Nigeria, and making sure that they get the psychosocial support needed, especially if they have lost any of their members of their family due to the conflict. In addition, we work with the authorities and making sure that camps or spontaneous settlement where IDPs settle are free from any gender-based violence risk. In Bangladesh, we ensure that Rohingya women and girls have access to safe spaces. These are spaces where they can get emergency health assistance, specialized relief items as well as hygiene kits, counseling and any other tailored assistance which is particularly relevant in case they've been survivors of gender-based violence. What we do is we do visits to detention facilities where migrants are currently placed in order to do our continuous protection monitoring as well as identification of new vulnerable cases and to provide assistance to cases that you have previously identified. There is a case of a nine-year-old boy from an African origin who lost all of his family, uh, one brother, one sister, his mom and his dad were lost at sea and there was no hope of locating any of his family members because of his young age. Uh, he didn't even know where his hometown is in his country of origin. Uh, we were lucky enough that we advocated through a campaign in his country of origin locate his grandfather where he is now reunited with him. As crises become more complex, humanitarian agencies have to ensure that protection is at the center of every response and IOM is working towards making this commitment a reality.